okay uh, welcome viewers so in this video lecture we want to learn about factorial polynomials okay this topic uh, will be used while solving questions of uh, non homogeneous recurrence relations okay so that is why we are studying this topic okay now what are factorial polynomials okay uh, there are two types of polynomials there are two types of polynomial number 1 general polynomial number 2 factorial polynomials okay uh, what are general polynomial uh, any polynomial which looks like this x square plus x plus 1 or x cube plus x square plus 5 okay uh, these polynomials you people study Uh, when you were in your tenth class, eleventh standard or twelfth standard. Okay. Now, uh, what are factorial polynomials? Okay. A uh, factorial polynomial they look like this. X raised to the power two factorial. It is read like factorial. Okay. Uh, X raised to the power one factorial plus X raised to the power zero factorial. So uh, these are called factorial polynomial. Like X raised to the power three factorial. Plus x raised to the power zero factorial. Okay, so these are called factorial polynomials. Now, now we see that uh, that what is the relation between general polynomial and factorial polynomial. So first thing is this, which you always remember that x raised to the power zero factorial. Uh, it is equal to, uh, it is equal to one. Okay. X raised to the power zero factorial. This is equal to one, and one can also be written like this: X raised to the power zero. Okay, so uh, when you write it in factorial notation, then you put this bracket. Okay, uh, and when it is your general polynomial, then you write it like this. Okay, do not put any bracket. Okay, so X raised to the power zero factorial. This is equal to one, and X raised to the power zero. This is also also equal to one. Okay, now next is X raised to the power one factorial. X raised to the power one, it is equal to x. Now, after this uh, changes occur, okay, x raised to the power two factorial, uh, this is equal to x into x minus one, okay, uh, only, okay, uh, and if you are given this thing, x raised to the power three factorial. So it is equal to x x minus one into x minus two. Okay. So this is how you write the factorial polynomial. So further, if you want to write x to the power four factorial, so it is something like this: x x minus one x minus two x minus. Okay. Now next, we want to learn this thing. that how can we find value of general polynomial uh, in terms of factorial polynomials okay so next we want to learn this thing that write general polynomial polynomial uh, in terms of in terms of factorial polynomial okay so you see that that uh, x raised to the power 1 factorial uh this is equal to x okay so wherever x is given there you can write x raised to the power 1 factorial so remember this all okay remember this all now 
next you see that x raised to the power 2 factorial this is equal to x into x minus 2 now from this i want to find the value of x square okay so multiply this x inside this bracket so it is x square minus x okay so it is x square minus x now further notice that above we said that that uh, this x okay uh, in terms of factorial polynomial uh, it is equal to x raised to the power 1 factorial okay because x uh, this is equal to x raised to the power 1 factorial now from this find the value of x square so x square is what it is x square factorial plus x raised to the power 1 so this is the second formula which I want you people to okay. so remember uh, remember okay now next we want to find the value of x cube okay now we want to find the value of x cube so what is x cube factorial x cube factorial this is equal to x into x minus 1 uh, into x minus 2 so this is equal to x okay you multiply this x with x x into x is x here then multiply this x with this so it is minus 2x multiply this one with this so it is minus x multiply one with this so it is minus minus plus two. okay so it is what it is x x here minus 3x plus 2 so it is what it is x cube minus 3x here plus 2x okay so you see that that from this we want to find the value of x cube okay so we want to find the value of x cube in terms of uh, factorial polynomial so it is x raised to the power 3 factorial this is equal to x raised to the power 3 minus 3 times what is x square? x square a it is x square factorial plus x raised to the power 1 factorial. Okay. Plus 2 times x can be written as x raised to the power 1 factorial. Uh, okay, I just explained it uh, in the early portion that how do we get this thing. Okay. Now I am using those things here. Okay. So this is x cube minus 3 times x raised to the power 2 factorial minus 3 times x raised to the power 1 factorial plus 2 times x raised to the power 1 factorial so this is equal to x raised to the power 3 minus 3 times x raised to the power 2 factorial minus 3 plus 2 it is what it is minus x raised to the power 1 okay. now what you do you bring uh, these two terms to the other side okay so it 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 then becomes it then becomes x cube in this x cube value it is equal to x cube factorial plus 3 times x square factorial plus x raised to the power 1 okay so uh, mainly uh, in the exam you are given question up to this only okay uh, but if you are asked that uh, find uh, x4 in terms of factorial for polynomial then uh, using the same method you can find it okay but mainly up to x cube uh, you will be asked to convert it into factorial polynomial so in nutshell i re remind you once again that x raised to the power 1 factorial this is equal to x only okay and x raised to the power 2 uh, this is equal to x raised to the power 2 factorial plus x raised to the power 1 factorial and x raised to the power 3 this is equal to x raised to the power 3 factorial okay plus 3 times x raised to the power 2 factorial plus x raised to the power 1 factorial so you people remember these three formula okay so these will be used for solving the questions okay uh, now uh, more about it will be discussed in the next class thank you very much students